Hey guys, this is Lungaya, and welcome back to Life is Strange Before the Storm. Uh, we were trying to get some monies. So let's have a look see. The dinner choices are steak or steak. <laughs> Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? No wonder you're so into football. Hmm. Okay, use computer. I didn't realize Drew was this good at sports. I bet he can't wait to get out of Arcadia Bay. Frank wasn't lying. Looks like Drew sells happy pills to his fellow meatheads. Hmm. So many folks are shit out of luck around here. At least Drew has some prospects. Okay. Too bad I lost my release form. I was really looking forward to running all those sweaty laps. <laughs> we might have failed to kill you, Durgeron, but something tells me Mikey's not through yet. <laughs> Bad guys don't usually look so obvious, but this is still awesome. Huh, <laughs> awesome. Mikey's figures. <laughs> Playing that game yesterday was actually fun. <laughs> Looks like Mikey's been staying here with Drew. Okay. <laughs> they look so happy. Mm -hmm. oh. Look at this. Oh, man. Looks like Drew's dad is having a hard time. Oh. And we're taking money from him? This really feels bad. Is the money in there? All right. Guess I have to crack a four digit code. Damn it. Wrong. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Wrong numbers. Might actually need some help with this one. Twelve twenty seven. One, two, two, seven. Coming up. Uh, worth a shot. Yes! <laughs> this is kind of fun. <laughs> oh. Did little Drew beat you up too? <sighs> Jackpot. I'm kind of good at this. <laughs> okay, got the money. Time to bust out of here. I knew it. <laughs> hey, Elamon. Chloe? What are you doing here? Mm, looking for Drew? I was <laughs> looking for your brother, but uh, he's not here, so... Why? Bro, we gotta go. Yesterday wasn't enough? You wanna go another round? Doesn't matter. Mikey, get your stuff, let's move. Shit. You're making me think you're nervous about something. Who's that? Who the hell is that? No one. Stay in here and don't say anything, <sighs> little brother. Whatever you do, don't open the door. Okay. You know what's going on? Damon, 
You shouldn't have come here. School's not the place for this. Really? Where is the place to collect my fucking money? Shit. I told you, I don't have it. Sales are down, man. Nobody wants to get high right now. But look, it's spring season. We just started two-a-days. Those are gonna kill us. I'll be able to sell all the oxy you've got. Drew, you owe me a grand. Where is it? I said I don't have it right now. I heard about your dad's job, by the way. Tough times. Yeah. Bet a grand would mean a lot to him right now. Where's my money, Drew? I don't know what you expect me to do. I can't just make money appear out of thin air. Oh, I want my fucking money! You don't have to hit me, man. I'm gonna... Oh. Where is it? Oh. Please! Just give me one week. Oh. You're just going to lie there? I thought football players were supposed to be tough. Sorry to have to do this, kid. No one steals from me. No one. Fuck. Fuck. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna feel like a bad person. I'm gonna stay with Mikey, I'm sorry. Let me go! No! Your brother said to stay inside. It'll be okay, Mikey. It'll be okay. Damn, you were one tough kid. Fuck you. Yeah? Well, what about this? Good luck running on that knee now. I Bye -bye. knew that would happen. Well, I'm done. Get my money. Or maybe it'll be your little brother I talk to next. See you soon. Uh, uh, Drew! It's, it's okay. I'm okay, little brother. Thank you, Chloe. Thank you. Oh God! <laughs> I feel like a really bad person if I keep it now. Oh. Oh my gosh. <sighs> if I give him the money... Oh my gosh, I actually feel queasy. <laughs> if I give him the money, he would know that I was stealing from him if I keep the money. I don't know. What else would happen? Oh God, I'm gonna be a bad person. I... I didn't do anything. You kept my brother safe. Drew? You need to get to the hospital. <sighs> don't tell anyone about this, okay? Yeah, uh, no. No way. What, um, what are you going to do? <sighs> about Damon? I don't know. No, <sighs> about your knee. One day at a time. I hear you. Bad. I really feel bad.
This day has been so messed up. And that's before having to watch Victoria butcher Rachel's role. <laughs> At least I can be here for Rachel. <laughs> if I can find her. Um, let's see... He held on to Mikey. He told me it meant a lot to him. Oh. Okay. What else did she say? Okay. Chloe, it's Steph. I am on my way to the hospital. Mikey told me what happened. Poor Drew. I'm still stunned. Thank you for what you did. I didn't do anything. Okay. Go to the props table. Of all the possible scenarios involving Victoria Chase and swords, this one is easily the least exciting. SG. Must be Steph. Sucks that she has to miss this. Chloe Price presents Firewalk Laser Light <laughs> Spectacular. <laughs> okay, is it maybe just me? <laughs> that is not really good at. It feels like everything is uh, like the, the, gosh, I can't find the words. <sighs> the stick that you use for looking, like this one. It's just so loose. See, another reason to be thankful for my uh, recent life change. <sighs> Drew seems to be the captain of every Blackwell sport. Man, I hope he's okay. Me too. Sports just look so... Uh, exhausting. Mm. Did Doug dig David's garden? Or did After David all the work Steph did, it's, it's amazing that she would drop everything to be there for Mikey. Looks That's like what Victoria you... has finally pushed Dana did Doug over the dig edge. David's garden, or did yep. David dig That's what you do, you know. Just throw did down Doug everything if garden, you love someone. Did David dig you know. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm really hey, sleepy. Dana. <sighs> did Doug dig David's garden, or did David dig Doug's? Did Doug dig How David's garden, know. or did David? <laughs> Did Doug dig David's garden? Tongue or twister, David? what now? Okay, what is she? It's going too fast. I'll wait until she finishes. Or they finish. So I can read it. Like a normal person. Okay, yes. Okay, this is annoying. Where is it? Rachel. Because <sighs> she can't scroll up when people are texting each other. <gasps> um, let's see. Mm. I don't even know where she started. See you soon. Uh, how's your super long errand going? Yo, crazy shit happened in Drew's room. Like, really bad. Oh no, are you okay? Do you need to talk about it? Yeah, later. Too many people around now. I'm backstage. Great. OMW. On my way. Drama teachers always seem so <laughs> dramatic. Sup, Mr. Keaton. Ah, uh, the birds, the girl, the desire to be free. Oh, 
How romantic. Tell me, young lady, do you still believe true love exists? <laughs> sure, I think so. But it's a lot weirder and scarier than poets and pop songs make it out to be. <laughs> you might be surprised, my dear. Budding dramaturge, may your propitious appearance counteract the tragedy of Stephanie Gingrich's sudden recusal. An emergency, she says. <laughs> Word. <laughs> Stephanie was our lion of the light board, but platitudinal though it may be, the show must sojourn forth. That dude is weird. <laughs> okay, talk to Hayden. Even Hayden seems super into this play. What is happening? Hey, Hayden. Address me as Ferdinand, good lady. Uh, all right, um, hey, Ferdinand. Sup, Chloe. I mean, sup, fair maiden. <laughs> Great, uh, method acting. Really? Thanks. Okay. Anything else? Let's go in. Boys changing tent. No, oh, okay. Thanks, but no thanks. I'm sorry, did not know from the outside. Did I? Nope, not really. I should find Rachel. That's some shameless eavesdropping there, Samantha. Hey, Samantha. Shh. <laughs> Nathan, please. I can't do it, Dad. I'm sorry. Keep your voice down. Now listen to me. That's awkward. Let's go. <laughs> oh. Bitter much? I don't get bitter. I get even. Wonder which bachelor contestant Victoria stole that line from. <laughs> okay. Did Doug dig David's garden? Or did David dig Doug? Rachel? Come on, V. You got this. You got this. Oh, shit, shit, shit. I can't do this. I'm going to ruin the play. What are you two doing here? Or did you forget? You let this loser dropout sabotage you. Just like she tried to sabotage me yesterday. <laughs> but really, I should be thanking you. Now I have everything I wanted. And you've got a new friend. So I guess we're both doing great. Now please leave so I can get ready for my performance. Even though I wish I was the one performing tonight, Victoria, I really am happy for you. I hope it's everything you want it to be. We both do. Right, Chloe? Yes. Yeah, I guess. I mean, even if you are super lame to me all the time, <laughs> I hope you don't completely suck up there. And even if you do suck, who cares? I mean, let's be real. You're not Rachel. <laughs> but that's okay, because you're Victoria Chase, you know? <laughs> Even if you suck. Okay. Uh, oh my god. Thank you. Oh, that's exactly what I needed to hear. Uh, okay. Cool. Tea? For your instrument. We want you at your best tonight. Ooh. Is there sleeping pills in there? Okay, V. Time to shine. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
<laughs> Christ, that was epic. You distracted her just long enough for me to slip those pills into her tea. Hey, dude. <laughs> oh, hey. Uh, that's mine. A shirt for a free spirit. I knew you were going to pick that one. You can read me like a script, Rachel Amber. <laughs> oh, okay. I better start getting into costume before the... Sweet party. We're ruined. The show is ruined. That was quick. <laughs> My dear young artists, a misfortune most unkind has befallen us. Juliet is waylaid. That infernal inferno is the culprit, closing down the roads and robbing us of our aerial. Would that she could but manifest on her master's whim as a true spirit. Alas, devoid of an understudy, the situation is a dire one indeed. I'm afraid we may have to cancel. Truly, we are a cursed lot. Even my prodigious imagination cannot conceive of a worse turn of fate. <laughs> Touche. <laughs> Mr. Keaton, Great timing. perhaps I could fill in for Victoria? My dear, your visage is as a vessel sent by the heavens to offer passage to my stranded soul. But I'm afraid without our Ariel, all is still lost. Oh no. Oh no. What? Oh no. <laughs> uh, uh, oh no. Mr. Keaton, <laughs> no. Chloe could step in for Juliet. No fucking chance. At least until the road's clear. The romantic. She's the right fit for Juliet's costume. She is indeed. Tell me, my dear, have you ever acted before? Hell no. <laughs> she's being modest. We play improv games all the time. And she's fantastic at it. My dear, what if I told you that the entire fate of the production rests upon your slender shoulders? Oh, okay, no pressure. I'd say you're super fucked. <laughs> Chloe, please. For me. <sighs> okay. Damn it. <laughs> I can't believe Rachel's talked me into this. I seriously have to memorize all of this? Thanks, Rachel. Wow, that's a lot of lines. For such a short time. Okay. Let's read the one of Frank first. Okay. Okay, it's been 20. Okay, okay, I'm on it. Hurry up. I just talked to Damon. He said he had to come down hard. Didn't, didn't see you. What happened? Did you find the money? Price? Where's the money? This is serious. Quit bleeping around. Unless you're dead, reply. Let's meet tomorrow. Have answers. And Elliot says, um, Okay. Hey, after Tempest, you want to hang out? Tempest is going to be awesome. Like, awesomely bad, I mean. It's going to be hilarious. Hey, don't worry about suspension, okay? Dude, I'm fine. Chloe, the show is starting. We got great seats. Where are you? Oh, you'll see. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least I'm not standing him up. <laughs> it's not my fault. Oh, great bird costume. That is lovely. Okay. <laughs> it wouldn't be called a makeup mirror if it wasn't supposed to have makeup all over it. Should I? Ah, just for when fun. life gives you lipstick. Use it to tag shit. <laughs> Tragedy. Got it. <laughs> Vanity Fair. 
Nice. Okay. Look at this. Why does it feel like Steph is mocking me from afar? Is there anything else in here? The only thing worse than looking at spandex is being forced to wear it. <sighs> Looks like I'm late. As usual. Ah well. Okay. Nothing else? Anything on the ground? Nope. Okay, let's go then. See what happens. By accident, most strange. Bountiful fortune hath mine enemies brought to the shore. Here. Cease more questions. Thou art inclined to sleep. Tis a good dullness, and give it way. I know thou canst not choose. Come away, servant. Come. Ah, shit. I'm on. <gasps> oh, uh, that's I you. I am ready now. Get <laughs> up there. Approach, my Ariel. Come. Damn it. <laughs> no problem. I've got this. I just walk to Rachel and say my line. That I don't remember. <sighs> really? Hello? No option? That looks so comfortable right now. <sighs> really, I need to look I at wish all the stuff. throw that at Rachel for getting me into this. Oh, that's pretty. I bet Steph designed it. <laughs> I'm definitely supposed to do something with this. I want to play her part. <laughs> <laughs> Just sitting there like a shipped wreck. <laughs> Ugh, that killed my eyes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Finally. Rachel looks way too pleased with herself for getting me into this. <sighs> All hail, great mistress. I, uh, I come to answer thy best pleasure. Most fearless, generous spirit. Hast thou performed to point the tempest that I bade thee? I don't know. <clears throat> I, uh, wrought a storm across the seven seas, raining and, uh, raining shit. The king's own ship I saw such rain assail, and by this detail knew it for thy work. Well done. Who was so firm, so constant, that this coil would not infect his reason? Uh, not a soul. The king's son, Ferdinand, was the first man that leaped from his ship and cried. Hell is here? I don't know. Cried, hell is here, and all the devils are here, uh, because hell is here. <laughs> Close enough. Uh. <laughs> but are they, Ariel, safe? All right, I guess this is when I'm supposed to walk somewhere. Okay, let's walk somewhere. I'm definitely supposed to do something with this. Ah, Chloe, stand here. Okay. <laughs> Not a hair perished, and uh, as thou baddest me, I have dispersed them about the aisle in troops. Bravo. <laughs> Thy charge exactly is performed. But there's more work. 
Is there more toil? Let me remember thee what thou hast promised. How now? What is't thou canst demand? My liberty. Indeed. <laughs> Thy liberty? Nay, this most of all I will not grant. Th that's not her line. Is it? What's going on? But thou assured my freedom. Didn't thou? I never said how dearly I hold thee. My habit's been to keep my soul well draped. Most loyal spirit, companion, and friend, is acting in my service not replete with excitement, amusement, and delight? Of course, mistress. Most truly, it is so. Mr. Keat, they're way Shh. off script. <laughs> it's magical. <laughs> then why, I pray you, wish you to be free? Excitement's a mere counterfeit of bliss. These storms and these adventures... I prefer to know thou still cared for my plainest self. I have thee in my grasp. I will not bend. I will not see thee flying forth alone. The envy would be more than I could bear. So come with me. Is that not in thy power? Spirit, take my hands. Most faithful friend, for but a little longer I beseech. Continue in thy service to my schemes. And when they are complete, I swear to thee, we shall fly beyond this isle. The corners of the world are mere prologue. I'll seek to make thy happiness so great that in the name of liberties forgot. What sayest thou to my most hopeful wish? Say yes! Mm -hmm. Yes, I am most pleased. Your duty done for now, so go forth hence with haste. I've work to do. Thanks, Chloe. Well done. An admirable effort. And the ending... absolutely transformative. I am... humbled. <laughs> no problem. What the hell just the happened? Of your Was soul, that real? Heaviness in me. Shake it off. Come on. We'll visit Caliban, my slave. Tis a villain, sir. I do not love to look on. He does make our fire, fetch in our wood. What ho! Slave! Caliban! Come forth, I say! On! Uh, mm. As wicked do, as e'er my mother brushed. Thou poisonous slave, got by the devil himself, filth as thou art. I have lodged thee in mine own cell, till thou didst seek to violate the honor of my child. Shit. He's crying. Fetch us in fuel, and be quick. So, slave, hence. Fuck you. Where should this music be? In the air? Or the earth? Oh, thank God. This play is super intense. What is it? A spirit? It carries a brave form, but it is a spirit. No wench. 
It eats and sleeps and hath such senses as we have. I will resist such entertainment. Put thy sword up, traitor! Do you love me? O oh, heaven, O oh, earth, bear witness to this sound. I beyond all limit of what else in the world do love, prize, honor you. His tears run down his beard like winter's drops from eaves of reeds. Go release them, Ariel. My charms I'll break, their senses I'll restore, and they shall be themselves. Now my charms are all o'erthrown, and what strength I have's mine own. Pray, release me from my bands, with the help of your good hands. Wasn't that fun? You're so dead. Yeah? How dead? Hella dead. Okay, well, I think I'm gonna stop recording here, guys. Ah. That was intense. Yes, and maybe a little bit boring, but huh, I hope you guys liked it still. So yeah, don't know what to tell you guys. It's yeah. <laughs> it was a play. Anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe. Ring that bell. And I'll see you guys on the... Bye!